Hey guys, in today's video, I will be making, um, a video on how to make a really good, pretty good pre-hard mode grinder. And it's actually really good. As you can see, I have my hard mode character here. I have a super flat world, and, yeah. So I will be showing you how to make the grinder. So first, the grinder, I'm not going to show you it yet because I want you to watch the video. <laughs> but, um, because if I show you, you'd probably build it. You'd take a picture of it and build it just by looking at it. So first off, you might want to build like a, a gnome. He's dead now, but build like a 15 block deep hole. Right, and, um, make sure it's super, like, um, super duper even. Like, it's a complete square. Not like a full square, it could be like a rectangle. Whatever you want the shape to be. The bigger, the better. That's what she said. But, um, put a torch at the bottom. The torch at the bottom, so you can see what, um, stuff you can get. Now just excavate all of this. I don't want to fly up and dig. If you have wings, if you, use, you can use the fletchling wings or anything. You just even use shoe climbers. Fairy wings are the best wings for early pre-hard mode. I'll fill that in. Oh, he's already in the grind trap. So, it's pretty cool. I really like this setup. It's really nice, really easy. It's not like one of those cool, like, wired trap ones. But yes, this is how you make it. And then I like to put little things right here. So anything that could fly out will always bump their head, like a demon eye, up against us so they cannot go back out. So yes. It's already a lot of slimes coming, but yeah. Oh, that might be an issue. It's too much, like too big. So yeah, just use one. So anything that can jump high always bumps right up against the ceiling and falls back down. So yes, there's step one. Build a hole, do this. All right, now find the middle, like the middle. So I'd say it's about right there. Yeah, that's the middle, almost. But yes, now after that's complete, we might have to make it two blocks. Um, build something in the sky. Let's go up here. Place a block. Hurry up. There we go. So, you do not have to place what I just placed. Build a sky tower. Oh, come on. We're gonna break the sky tower soon anyways. But yes, there we go. Might want to build up just a wee bit more. Now, build something like this. Alright, so three out. There's that. There. We're gonna want to make it as even as possible. Alright, so just about there. Now you're gonna want to get platforms. So let's get some platforms going. About two. And then two. Alright, now break these three things right here and put even more platforms. Now you're going to want to get your hammer, super close since so you guys can see it, make this a ramp, and make this super flat, like this. You're going to want to make it spacious and safe as possible, something like this, and you're going to want to do this, and then this. 
now, do that, and place your three platforms, and make this a ramp, just like that. So there's that, pretty much it's almost done. Now you're going to want, you could put a crafting bench, workbench, right here, put a torch lighting inside, and then I usually like to add walls as decoration to clean it up. We added just a weenty bit too much. Hold up. There we go. So now I can shoot through it, as you can see. I can shoot through it. I can even shoot down here. And you're safe. So I also usually like to add little pivots. You could add the ramps, but if you want to be super safe, you can add something like this. So, like, no, so demon eyes bounce off and nothing can get into it. And then now you're going to want to break your sky tower. You could add a campfire in there and add the crafting bench on top, anything that could heal you. Now you're just going to want to break all this. Do not fall into your trap. I do, I do that every single time I go into my trap. I don't know why. You're going to want to zoom out. As you can see, you can, you can see the bottom. And if you want, you could even do a grappling hook. I u I add rope, but I couldn't add rope to this one since I didn't have any today. But, uh, yeah, come on. I'm just gonna kill all you guys. But, if you have a bow, you can even use minions. Minions work. But yes, you can add, like, a grappling hook. If you add a grappling hook, you're just making yourself a target, but they still cannot reach you. Come on. It's getting nighttime. There we go. So yes, if we would like whip out a minion, he could kill. These slimes are easy. Usually I just sit here and AFK. So yeah. It's uneven, I just noticed. I mean, it makes it even. There we go. Really? Here we are. Now we just gotta wait until it's night time. And yeah, here's a grinder. Really easy, you could shoot through it. As you can see, you can shoot through it. With any of your guns, whoops. And if you just wanna sit there and grind for money, just, just zoom out. And use your gun, any gun that you want. A bow is good. You could even shoot up here. You could even go up here, shoot some demon eyes. You can even go on this pillar, shoot some stuff like this. Have a friend go up there. But yes, I usually I hammered everything down to as small as I possibly could, because you're gonna want the most less space that you could find, but you're also gonna want um protection. You see, I can't go through this, so yeah. Less space, but you still need protect protection of all the creatures. Like, look, it just just from now, we j we already have an iron skin potion. Let's see how much money we made out of that time. Not good. Not good for slimes. The, a player could easily jump over that. There's a gnome. Could also just be overpowered and use the deadliest storm bow. That would actually work too. Using deadliest storm bow going inside of the thing. Or you could just um use a grappling hook. Go all the way down. Use the deadliest storm bow. Or 
the mega shark as you can see but yeah there you guys go really easy grinder there goes my fan but I'll show you what um the my grinder looks like on my world I have a few of them it's gonna be a part three no like a th three part series of grinding but yeah this is that was this is part one part two is gonna be a pirate invasion farmer but no that's yeah part three pirate invasion farmer part two is gonna be a king slime farm these are all pretty hard mode pirate invasions hard mode but you can still make it in pretty hard mode and wait until hard mode until you have a pirate invasion thing but yeah this is really cool. I think the pirate invasion farm is easy. Same, kind of of the same concept, but you go underground instead of up, up ground. Well, above ground, and there's lava. Of course it's raining. This world's glitchy. I think it's because the rain. Oh, of course it's a block. And the light. No, I'm breaking the world. This is just the hut I made, just in case. That's right next to the pirate invasion farm. It's only glitchy like this when I record. But he, uh. The painter's house. This is crazy. It's magical. It's my underground tunnel. What's that? Here, I'll just give you a little tour of my world. There, so that's what it looks like. Nothing too serious. I like the Excalibur. It gives off a lot of light, and the wings do too. Ready? See, they give off light. More light than a torch. Oh, come on, really? Come on, stupid thing. Really gonna have to go through this? No! No! <laughs> I never game rage. Terraria is relaxing. That's what I think. Here it is. Mine is more... I put more time into this. So you can see I have rope for the pre-hard mode. Because this is my pre-hard mode farm. It's the first time a pixie has ever went in there. But yeah, as you can see, same concept. Instead, I put ramps here because the unicorns know how to glitch through the thing. So, yeah. I can actually see the bottom. Mine's not that deep. So, if I just get out my MP, I can just sit here and farm all these pixies. I even have, oh, I thought I had my blue, my blue torch. Oh, a rainbow slime, look at that. Excuse my thing right here. Oh, look at that, he already landed to the grind thing. So, yeah. Look at that. Well, yeah. That's my setup. But yes, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope, like, and subscribe. And yes, I made all the money I make, I always get from here. And my other farmers. But yeah. So I hope you guys enjoy this video, like and subscribe, and yeah, see ya.